set up git so we already saw about uh, downloading and installing the latest version of git we already did the set your username in git now we're gonna do number three set your commit email address in git so we're gonna click here in this link and you can go here to this link that is i'm showing you here setting your commit email address you can set the email address that is used to author commits on github.com and on your computer so if you have a mac you're gonna choose this option if you have a linux you're gonna use this option here i have a window so i'm gonna show you this option so in this article we have about commit email addresses setting your commit email address on github setting your commit email address in get so right now we have about commit email addresses github uses your commit email address to associate commits with your account on github.com you can choose the email address that will be associated with your commits you push from the command line as well as web-based get operations you make for web-based get operations you can set your commit email address on github.com for commits you push from the command line you can set your commit email address and get any commits you made prior to changing your commit email address are still associated with your previous email address so here we have a note you cannot verify email addresses from disposable email address services uh, parentheses services that allow you to receive email at a temporary address that expires after a certain time if you'd like to keep your email address private you can use a github provided no reply email address for more information see setting your commit email address on github so if you're interested in that you can read this article here uh, but now if you'd like to keep your personal email address private you can use a no reply email address from github as your commit email address to use your no reply email address for commits you push from the command line use the email address when you set your commit email address in get to use your no reply address for web based get operations set your commit email address on github and choose to keep my email address private uh, you can also choose to block commits you push from the command line that expose your personal email address um, for more information uh, see blocking command line pushes that expose your personal email you can read this link to ensure that commits are attributed to you and appear in your contributions graph use an email address that is connected to your account on github.com or the no reply email address provided to you in your email settings for more information see adding an email address to your github account so here you have some note about uh, if you created your account on github.com after july 18 2017 your no reply email address for github is an id number and your username in the form of id plus username at user that no reply that github.com if you created your account on github.com prior to july 18 2017 your no reply email address from github is username at users that no reply that github.com you can get an id based no reply email address for github by selecting or deselecting and reselecting keep my email address private in your email settings okay here if you use your no reply email address for github to make commits and then change your username those commits will not be associated with your account on github.com this does not apply if you're using the id base mm -hmm no reply address from github for more information see the changing your github username as you can see there's a bunch of links for prime for pretty much everything so if you have any doubts you just you can read this documentation but here setting your commit email address on github if you haven't enabled email address privacy you can choose which verified email address 
do author changes with when you edit, delete or create files or merge a pull request on GitHub. If you enabled email address privacy, then the commit author email address cannot be changed and is inside angle brackets username at users that no reply that github.com by default. So in the upper right corner of any page, click your profile photo, then click settings. So we're gonna go to our to our GitHub account, to our GitHub um the official website and we're gonna log in. So this is my account here. I'm already logged in and they say okay in the upper right corner of any page click on your profile photo then click settings so in my profile click settings settings here okay and then we're gonna see your profile your repositories organization settings 